What's up everybody, this is Hawks here from Hawks Games, and today I just want to make a quick video just to discuss this little debacle that's been going on with Microsoft. Now, we've already got the release date for the PlayStation 4. That would be, it was November 15th in US, and it's November 30th in Australia, as far as I can remember. I don't have the source here, or well, the many sources that I had, but it was something around like that. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. But... It's just, it, it's good that they have that date out there, because then people can expect one again, they can start saving for it, but Microsoft hasn't announced theirs yet, and they've only got a target launch date of November 2013. Now, well, it's, this recently drew up because of Mountain Dew and Doritos Every Two Minutes contest, so everyone just knows, look, it's going to be November still. But everyone's got this big question, they're saying, oh, look, you've got to get this date out, because then you can beat the PlayStation 4, and I, I honestly agree, I mean, it's it's not like they, they could place it in a certain area to beat the PlayStation 4, I mean, if they want to get this Xbox One making good sales, they just need to put out good games, because I could, you could have the PlayStation 4 coming out two days before the Xbox One, and, you know, like, it, it wouldn't make a big difference for me, I'm still getting the Xbox One, yeah, I, I crossed over, they changed the policy, so it's all good now, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, I'll pick up a PlayStation 4 next year, but it's just, it, it's a lot, makes a lot more sense if they release a console, and, you know, maybe it's a good, I'm not a big marketing man, so I wouldn't know about console releases the last time, I haven't, this is the first, like, upgrade from the home console generation of of experience, I mean, like, I was around when the Wii and 360 and PS3 were released, but I, I didn't pay much attention, so technically I wasn't around, but, like, if, maybe, this, I, I think it might be a good idea to give the PS3, I mean, PlayStation 4, this, all crazy, but the PlayStation 4 gets a good week, and then they put the PlayStation, oh, the, the Xbox One, the next week, so then it would be the 15th, and then seven days later, it would be the... Hang on, uh, it would be the 22nd, and then you give it another week of free time, and then next week will be Black Friday, so you've got this big, it'd be this big week of spread, spreading, and you know, like, it's going to be around about the same time in these 12 markets, apparently, I think it was 12 or 15 markets that Microsoft haven't planned, the rest have got to do localization issues and such, but, you know, that's just how it is. But if you just get it, I reckon if they get it like just after the PlayStation 4, because they've got decent lineup. They've got the decent day one lineup. I'm I'm fairly equal about PlayStation 4 and PlayStation, no, the Xbox One. I'm going to keep screwing up. But like, I'm fairly equal with the first party lineup because they're, they're great games out there. I mean, they've, they've got this, they've got a good lineup to start off with and they've got lots of ideas planned later on. If it's on the marketplace or on the store or if it's, like, um, or if it's just, like, full disc titles coming out later this year, or if there's, or if the PlayStation 4 wants to do something to link up with the Vita, then that's coming out soon, and they've even, like, made, made it more attractive, because they got a $100, um, price increase, I think it was, so they, they'd get more people buying PlayStation 4s and Vita, so they could have more compatibility, and it makes a lot of sense, I mean, I might even pick up one if the capabilities are really that big, but, I'm not. I'm not confirming anything yet, but but still, this is it's a big thing. I mean, they need to get this. As, as I'm thinking, they need to get this release date right because if they want to get if they want to get November correct, they could either get it a little bit before and it wouldn't change anything. But if they get it in that sweet spot just before Black Friday, I don't think there'd be that many sales because the console is literally just released. But if they get it like in a good spot, maybe not in the same week as PlayStation Three because that could screw things up a little bit. They, they both need their own weeks of fame or whatever, but if they could just get it in this nice sweet spot, give them a week of freedom, it would be, it'd just be spectacular. So that's all I have to say. That's my 10 cents on the matter. This is Hawksfear from Hawksfear Games. See you later.